Hello McWarriors, how's it going? And welcome to another episode of Rogue Deck, where we are going for some one-shot shenanigans. We have a Daisy Cutter Bomb, which deals a massive amount of Alpha Strike damage, and I want to implement it in one of our builds. So, let's go ahead, get the Marauder on top of the Order, get the Rack Lobster back in action. I think that's the thing that we need. Uh, Atlas is going down, Battlemaster is going up. Alright, so this is gonna be our repair order. We need five days for the Marauder. Uh, financial report coming up as well in seven days. Holy crap. Do we have a duel? There is a duo duel. Alright, we'll, we'll take that. We'll totally take that, but with our new build. So, let's go ahead and take a look at that. That's gonna be awesome, guys. So right now, uh, where is my Marauder? There it is. Okay, so right now we have, I think, a high explosive bomb and quad missiles running on this guy. I think we can do way better. So how much is that? 0 0.5 tons. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Do we have enough tonnage here? This is two tons? All right. We need two and a half tons. That's it. Boom. Daisy Cutter online. That's easy. That's super easy. Now, we, we lose a bit of sustain. That's right. That is actually quite a good chunk of damage that we deal with the quad missiles. It's 100 damage per alpha strike. We have four shots. Uh, but this here is 125 pinpoint plus 200 area of effect. And that is just massive. So let's go ahead and see what this thing can do. I'm very, very, very excited about this. All right. One day. Here we go. And we will be playing a duel. Absolutely. This is going to be a nice test run for this. We get 1.2 million sea bills, one salvage, and I'll take... I take my, my Demolition Squad. I'll take the Seth Bomber as well as the Marauder. That's gonna be great. Okay, Ifrit out. Out, 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 out. Should probably, should probably uh, make some, uh, how to say it, uh, some default lists for my max that I can save and load all the time. But hey, let's go in and see what we can do. All right, guys, let's go. I, I have no idea if we are going to one-shot or not, but the idea is there and the possibilities as well. I see an Atlas uh, 3 with double racks or something and a stealthed King Crab. That's not going to be easy, guys. Let's stay out way. of harm's way for the moment. I'm going on the left flank. Wait, did we generate a crazy amount of heat? No, 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 no. That was just, that was some visual shenanigan. So, Avenger Rifle. Oh, it's Baba Yaga. Streak MRM. Kind of nasty, mistake. but let's see. Yeah, that's the thing. I need them to come out of their spawn protection, though, so otherwise I cannot hit anything. Or I wouldn't deal damage armor. because of their Receiving guard you. state and everything. But hey, let's go in and bring the stealth bomber to the front. Speaking of stealth, the other guy is gone. Hmm, not good. So, we drop some bombs. Boom, boom. Target acquired. Ah, uh, King Crab is here, and it has AMS. Actually dangerous! Actually dangerous, guys. There it is, a King Crab with... What was that? Risk Hyper Assault, Gauss Rifles, or something like that. I'm gonna use my Supercharger here. Wanna generate more evasion? Come on. Yes, 15 evasion. We can, we can flank him, so we will. Daisy Cutter Bomb, 72% uh, hit chance, yeah. Daisy Cutter Bomb, 40% hit chance. No, 77. All right, I was freaking out for a second. Let's go. My flamer is out of Th that's it? That's all we got? That's not enough. Orders. Oh, no. <laughs> all right. I, I want to kill this, though. Are we going for a backstrike? I don't think so, no. No, we, we want to attack from the side again. Grinding through his back armor is not good here. All right. Um, so we get 10 evasion, you say? Let's go. Moving backwards. And we'll try to kill him. Got a crit on the engine, but that's all. Punch right oh, the boy. And he's going to initiate on us. No. I don't want that. Go away. All right, 80 damage, intimidated, sure. Better me than Lady it's Aron. Daisy Cutter. Uh, if I underrun this, I, I think I should be fine, right? Like going going in minimum distance so that he cannot hit me. Uh-huh. And then we're gonna go for, I think we need to go for the bombs actually instead of the missiles, because that guy has AMS. One down, one to go. Enemy 
down. Crazy duel. Reporting multiple weapons with no ammo. Ah, he's going for the other guy. Yuck. Ah, that's a crit on the ATM. I'm Not cool, man. Damage. Not cool at attention. all. So, supercharger stays on because I want to go fast. I need to go fast. It's so important. Uh, God, the stealth is a problem as well. Let's go for a backstrike. Watch your positioning better. He's open. Losing armor. Is it gonna be enough? I, I really feel like we need to kill now. Now. Order received. All right. How do we do it? With high explosive bombs? I feel like the answer is yes. Also, I'm gonna sensor lock that fool. Let's go. Maximizing our hit chance. Boom. We got him. Ooh, crazy. Super crazy. All right. That was good. That was actually good. Mission successful. It hurt a little bit. But in the end, uh, it was positive in terms of money outcome here. I think we can easily fix the crit. Nothing really broke. So, yeah, that's, that's, that's all right. I also wonder, do we or should we go for micro missiles instead of ATMs? ATMs are very versatile. Micro missiles uh, they have a good chunk of output. That's the thing. I don't know. I don't know what would be better here. I could take another Atlas. Good old Baba Yaga. Intimidating. Uh, this is not a good one, really. This is not one that I want now. Hot seat cockpit, stability gyro. That was Yaga. Let's see what's in the King Crab. Sheath beacon. Silver bullet Gauss rifle. That was the thing that hit us so hard. Bombast laser. Sure. Anything good here? Advanced AMS? Nah, 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 nah. I want Mark II. I really want Mark II. So what's the thing that's worth a bit? I don't see anything good here. Avenger rifle might be. Eh. I mean, it's an okay item. It's 20 tons. It's very heavy to hold. This is improved jump jets. Assault. Uh, no, thank you. Oh, boy. I mean, I could take one part of an atlas and hope that I get another part of an atlas. Build it, sell it, get some money. Let's do it like that. Ha, <laughs> we didn't get it. And by the way, I'm not running silver bullet gauss rifles because they have a misfire chance, right? Wait a second. Oh, wait. What, what, what was the drawback of these? Uh, cluster shot, sure. 150% crit bonus, sure. One evasion ignore, one accuracy, damage variation, alright. Cluster of six, six projectiles. They don't have that. They're just heavy, that's the thing. Might want to run this. I actually might want to run this. Ah, uh, the range is not that great. 450 meters optimal, 900 max. Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a questionable. I like the extra accuracy, though. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it and maybe I actually want to try this. At 14 ton is a lot to invest. Alright guys, we survived that. Repair cost? Mm, 150,000, 200,000, something like that. Also, I want to be a bit brighter. So, um, And I think the Timberwolf, the, the Flying Marauder, is gonna be out of action for 10 days minimum. And then we also have to fix the crit on the ATM. Oh boy. So yeah, what the hell are we doing with... I, I feel like, you know what? I feel like we should swap the build of the the Flying Marauder and the Timberwolf. Using the micro missiles in close range is easier when you have a massive amount of evasion, but having ATMs in short, mid and long range options on the Timberwolf would give it probably a little bit more light of day. Because it was just too risky bringing the Timber with only 8 evasion to the front line, because it's where it needs to be with the micro missiles. I do that. I'm gonna do that now. Yeah, I feel like I feel like we should change a little bit around and, and try new builds here. So let's go for it. Timberwolf RC, micro missiles out of here. Get out. Micros out. There we go. We're gonna get the ATMs in. And ooh, the cool thing is, we're running an exchanger and a jump booster, and I think I wanna keep both. And we're running a heat and a critical battle computer. What we can also do now is use our optics battle computer for better accuracy. I like that a lot. Okay. Um, and wait, we have... This is a battle mech, so not an omni. That means we cannot put any lower arm accuracy on the mech, sadly. 
Uh, that means, um, yeah. We're fine here. We're fine for the moment. All right. So, with Tim... Marauder is 10 days. <laughs> exactly 10 days to repair. Question is, do we play another mission without him? There's an assassination. Ooh, interesting. I want to play that. So, who can we get online again? None of these before the day ends or the month ends. Uh, this is risky. We have to use a lot of tanks. But we can. I'm gonna do it. Let's go. Alright. I'm not gonna waste too much time here. Let's let's go ahead and play the, the Furtive Kiwi. Playing Assassination in the Lowlands. Going for... 3 out of 12 is pretty good, actually. We get a good chunk of money still. And a good chunk of equipment. Let's go. Let's do it. Alright. So, the bomber is a no-brainer. We're gonna take the Battlemaster, we're gonna take the Direwolf, the King Crab, Dr. Pinchy. Sure, why not? Then, Archer is good. Uh, Vulture is also there. Perfect. Uh, I would have taken the Timberwolf now, but uh, who could have known? Ifrit is good. Rhino is perfect. We had 600 tons. We can take the... Von Luk no, we cannot take the Von Luk now. We can take the Phoenix Hawk. I don't know if that's a good idea. Sea Rider is, is currently out of action. Why, though? Internal damage? Seems like it. Okay. So, let's go ahead. Uh, wait, we couldn't take him anyway, right? No, we can now. We have an upgraded uh, tonnage uh, thingy. Blah, blah. Are we able to take the long term? We are able to take the long term. All right, so that's better. It's better than the flyer. Here we go, guys. Battlemaster, Wizard, Lone Wolf, Jester, Dr. Pinchy is... Is Neuron. Come on, Neuron. Archer, Hero, Vulture, Bullet Trap. Here we go. Ifrit is Gremlon. Where's Gremlon? There we go. Long Tom. Anybody good with a Long Tom? Yes, Ether can do it. Yes, Finnin can do it. Uh, does it matter? Not really. We're gonna take those two. Let me quickly check. Who's good on the Rhino, anyway? Nobody yet, right? Okay, so that's gonna be our squad. We are mildly over, but the thing is, we have a lot of tanks, which are not really that, that optimized. But let's be real, our mechs are also not really that, that optimized. Let's go. Let's have some fun. Second mission of the day. Let's see what we can do. We got supporting enemy forces. We got uh, the enemy dude guy. I think we're gonna go for the dude guy first, and then we're gonna go for the forces later. It's also pretty good because we have, you know, slight slope. We have the high ground. Seems good. And they have a support lance. Oh no. Oh, it's it's with the dude guy? Yeah. It's very dark right now, but it'll change as soon as we got somebody with night vision going for us here. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. The night is dark and full of terrorists. <laughs> Let's go. Am I getting demonetized now? Because I said it? I hope not. Please be gentle, YouTube. It's just what they say here. It's part of the mission. It's a video game, all right? Let's go. Cool. So, first round, we see a Grand Summoner, Plainsman, which is the guy. Huh. All right. Our prime target, Albatross. Yeah. Okay. So, Ifrit, let's go and boost it up to the super high ground. Want to see if there's more? I got it. Don't there's think. more. A Cascatel. Oh, boy. Run. Oh, boy. <laughs> Guys, prepare your AMS. This might be a, a rocket guy. Yeah, probably is. Look at all these missile weapons. Thanks, man. Zipping around. SRM-6 times two. Waiting for orders. Nothing too crazy and nothing to see. All right, I'm going to move and brace. Move Just going to split up a little bit because I don't want to get hit by a massive amount of whatever this guy's running. Nova? What else is there on the flank? Crusader. All right. What's up, huh? Guess these guys will still take some time before they get to us. Going full throttle. All right. We're good on the flank. Receiving you. Uh, Vulture. Move it up. On it. Important thing is that we kind of cover ourselves with AMS as good as possible. He's going slow, but still generates 10. He's running Thunderbolts and Mars. Uh huh. Talk to me. Cool. Jump. Taking to the air. And brace. Standing by. Lone Wolf also wants to jump and brace. 
Where do we jump to? On it. Clear. All right, DNI on. Let's go. Seventeen. I don't know what that was, but okay. Oh wait, it was the it was a gremlin with bolt on rocket. This guy's running a long time. Everybody's running long toms recently. Yes, boss. So crazy, man. So crazy. Rhino, go ahead and sprint to the front. You can take some damage. That's fine. You got armor. Roger that. No shooting. Just running. There we go. So here's the summoner. Grand summoner is uh, 70 ton. Yeah, okay. Has a lot of LRM-15 clan. And I want them. I still want to build my... My, my, my... What's it called? God. My vulture for clan LRMs. Long Tom, spy sad ping. I didn't forget. Got a lock. We know everything about you now. And your mom. And your browsing habits. Waiting for order. Alright, uh, Dr. Pinchy. Dr. Pinchy's gonna jump and brace. Confirmed. You can supercharge later. Okay, here we go. 23. It's a Cascatel, right? Oh, Cascatel is 20. And yes, you're running. Ooh. Double arrow on the wings and enter air rockets. Ooh, that makes it so that our flyers are a little bit endangered now. Anti air rockets. Also, thunderbolts. And two Mars launchers. The Mars is not really that big of a deal, but it deals damage. It's a primitive uh, thunderbolt launcher, basically. Here's a ghost. Don't you dare touching my rhino. And that's what she said. Let's go. Guys in front of us are relatively slow. Albatross, LRM-15, SRM-6, LD-10. Something with the rock. I'm a bit afraid of the summoner. Okay, damage is light. Who's the rock guy? Ah, wait, it was the Nova, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes, Good. Here. Now what? <laughs> I honestly want to get away from the Cascatel again, so we'll switch the flank to something else. It's my main target. The summoner needs to be a target. But again, I wanna I wanna switch flank. I wanna get away from this. Let's go here. Affirmative. Okay. 20%. 20%. 30-something percent, but no good range against the Crusader. I mean, I could take this guy. Is it worth it shooting the guided bombs? I guess so. Firing. Target damage. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. We won. Let's go home. <laughs> no, of course not. We will stay here. Also, no evac zone is weapons. this. There's no way we're gonna run away now, right? Turn 20. It's getting interesting now. Good news is we have a good chunk of AMS. Really wonder how much damage the summoner can do to us with all of our AMS stacked up right here. But we'll see. Cascatel comes in. Has a lot of missiles as well. Going fast. Going really fast, actually. There it is. Always for the dire world, you bastards. Always for the big boy. Reporting. The guy Take that takes the lot. most money and time to repair. Yeah, 13 evasion, but he lost hit. the rockets and the Thunderbolt missile. It's not that dangerous wow. anymore. That was bad. Should probably My go for something else. Off. Only target we have is the Cascatel, though. So I guess we might as well shoot the Cascatel. Affirmative. It absorbs a lot of damage. Crazy. Yeah. Fine. Turn 19. 19 is the Gremlin. He has a long tom. And he will use it. And he shoots fire at us. You're gonna regret that. Yeah. I'm taking a pounding, Commander. Okay, still no line of sight. No commander. good line of sight at the very least. I could go down here and hit the summoner. With only two damage per missile, though. Confirmed. You know what? I feel like the this guy needs to go. And he needs to go now. So we'll go incendiary. As much as possible. Yeah, fire. Uh, 
I know I'm splitting my damage right now, but I have yeah. priorities, and the other shots were just uh, shots of opportunity. That's a good one here, though. I'll I'll take it. Is this my best range? For a direct shot. All right, we'll take it. The summoner wants fire, so we go inferno, 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 fire. Here we go. We cannot really hit him with damage, but we can certainly hit him with heat. Good. Blazing Inferno. Fine. Oof. Talk to me. Plasma Boy is going for the Gremlin. Yeah. Confirmed. Absolutely. Battle rifle, auto fire. Take, Take him down. Took him down. Great. So one long Tom Cannon off the board. That's huge. And we even overheated him, just for good measure. The last remaining parts are still smoldering. Cool. So 17 is the Albatross. He probably hit us. Feel like he wanted to shoot the Vulture and the Rhino took some hits for it. Straight shots. I'm under heavy fire. Yeah. So, now turn 16. Rhino! I love this thing. Until it's getting shred, then I don't love it anymore. So he was probably triggering some of the mines, but it didn't really have a big impact. Lone Wolf! Bring it to the flank, hit the Albatross, the Cascatel, the whatever it is. Lots of flying thingies. I don't know. I think I want to bring it down here so we can attack this as well, and we'll try to shoot into the sky. Okay, I think we didn't hit, but the AoE splash did some damage. I'm ready. Dr. Pinchy! Oh yeah. Let us go. What happens if I turn on supercharger and everything? Is there a line of sight to anybody? Come on, calculate that. You should be able to run faster. There we go. So that would be a charge attack, huh? Probably still viable. Let's go. Confirmed. Here we go. We hit him. Self damage exists. But that is a guy on the ground and we have massive damage on him. So yeah, that's self damage. Holy crap -aroni. We're not really made for that. But, you know, sometimes you've got to take sacrifices. Or make sacrifices. Okay. Copy that. I don't like the summoner. So Albatross is on the ground. Somebody else can take him later. I want to take the summoner down. Giving them everything I've got. This guy's scary. Waiting for orders. Okay. Long Tom. Everything's burning already. Let's move backwards, give it a good old flag shot into the sky, see what we can do. Machine guns as well, because we can. Fire. Commencing alpha strike. Still not. But almost. My armor's in bad shape. Follow my lead. Alrighty then. So the EMP can be shot into this no, it cannot be shot into the sky. Lame. Where do we go? Okay, we go here, we go vigilant, we go and try to kill Albatross now. I'm firing on the enemy. The only thing we got is heat. Take that. And one way. crit on the engine. Maybe a little panic. But he should be so impaired that he's not gonna really do anything this round. Should be fine. Turn 21. It's the Cascatel. Couldn't take him down. Nasty. Oh, yeah, Santa Lock. Ooh, boy. But that's actually good. The Long Tom can still take some beating and it can stay in the back if needed. No big deal. I like this shoulder mount, by the way. Do you see it? It's pretty cool, man. Yeah, he mostly missed. Man, we really gotta deal with, with our friends here. Good to go. Gotta do it quickly. What are we doing with the bomber? 
Standing by. Gonna wait for it. My goal is to attack the summoner a bit more. Stay in motion. Stay within the, the field of um, uh, anti-missile, whatever. And kill. Confirm. Okay, let's go. It's almost as good as a kill. Almost. Target's taken a critical hit. Good. So we sadly destroyed one of these LRM-15s, right? Yeah, one is down. But that's all right. Griffin. I don't care about that. Okay, another one. Let's take a bullet trap first because we got more missiles to shoot here. Go over there, finish. Grand Summoner. LK. Ah, uh, fire everything. I was thinking about not shooting my LRM clan because ammo is a thing. Let's go. But I guess we Let's have enough. Go. For this mission we have. Ready. So, that means we can drop the bombs in the other direction. Right here. Move order received. Hit the ghost, hit it big, hit it good. High explosives. Yeah, I'm gonna drop high explosive bombs. Give him everything you got. Cool. Got a light PPC crit and this guy unsteady. He's gonna have a turn now, so... He's gonna stabilize again. But I feel like dealing damage, he's good already. And he cannot sprint this round because he's unstable, so he's only gonna move. Yeah, and we have to set as a decoy on the flank. So we have a Battlemaster with a back turn towards the enemies down I'm below. Listening. That's a thing that's not good right now. But it's okay. We bring the other guy as well. Confirmed. Cool. And you know what? Uh, I think I'm gonna just do that. Here you go. It's a little bit of heat. I ain't Sadly, our no infant is not weapons. really good at dealing damage. That's the only thing that I dislike about it right now. Okay, dire Wolf coming in. One shot thumper and fire. Reporting. Made him unsteady Reporting. again. Black on AC-10 ammo. Okay, so I could go for the ghost, but I think what I should do is attack the flyer a little bit more. Maybe I stand and shoot this. Let's go. Firing. Down he goes. So Dr. Pinchy is Make ready to punch the albatross. That's good. And we have the long tom that can shoot into the low ground, big time. I think we have it in the bag already. And honestly, there's some interesting salvage. Commander. Again, the summoner has some things. Um, period. Summoner has some things. Seda is there. I'm gonna go for the griffin. Let's get some more heat on the guy. Yep. Yes, commander. Okay, Dr. Pinchy. We're gonna disable Supercharger, but we're gonna keep Hot Seat on, because I wanna punch with high damage. Rawr. And boom. Another headshot. I love when that happens. So good, man. So good. So this guy's dead. Let's keep going. This is a Nova, huh? Mm, I think I'm gonna go for the Nova actually. So Kaspar, what's going on here? Can I can I move you? you got my attention. Here we go. Move for ten. Get down here. And, and drop everything we got. Roger. Hit him hard. Again, unsteady. It's a Rock Two Clan. Orders. Mm, interesting. Okay. Roger Battlemaster. That. I really feel I want to hit the Nova a bit more. Uh, I should probably go for the Ghost. You brought this on yourself. Overheated. Noise. Good. Very well. You, my friend, you can hit the Nova. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Full speed. 
cool. This is really coming together now. Engaging with target. There goes the rotary. No, no rotary is on the other arm. Ooh. Or even on the torso. Who knows? That's interesting. Do I want this? I guess... Yeah? Commander? No? It's a rare item. It's really hard to find more of these, and one alone is not good enough. Uh, overheat, no, thank you. What do we shoot now? Let's go for the Nova. Actually, I want to... Hmm. I want the leg of the Nova, so we might uh, salvage the engine. Got it. Don't know if that's good enough, especially with a splash weapon like this. Oh, it's on now. Yes, we got the engine down. Hostile yeah, it's eliminated. fine. Okay. Receiving you. Important thing is that we are finishing the Let's mission. Go. It's Rhino. Rhino goes burr. Target confirmed. It is go time. Fine. Battle mech power up. So that's just a power up. We have a Griffin down here and we still have a Crusader. I don't think that these pose any big threat so far. Yeah, Lodge Pulse actually hits three times, so that's the ma the, mul the maximum amount of damage you could have dealt there. Commander. Um, that's a backstrike. I don't want a backstrike, I want a side attack. Yep. Give him help. Guess I'll give it to him then. Nope. So help. Commander. Dr. Pinchy, let's go. Jump it. Confirm. Raise it. Commander. Bob it, turn it. Position confirmed. Kill here. I don't know Tango. about this Diablo, yeah. man. It is questionable. I, we should really take regular Gauss rifles, not the North Storm ones. I like the crit idea and the splash, but Damage it's not really light. doing that much. Let's be honest. Uh, but yeah, hyper assault Gauss rifles would also be a thing. It would be fantastic. Uh, but we don't have it. Right, Commander. Oh. Oh! Be careful! Losing armor! This kills people, Car. That one was a bad one, right? Standing by. It's not good. Roger. Missiles. Double time. ATM. Here we go. Boom. Target confirmed. Mech warriors. Show them what you I'm got. I'm just cleaning up now. This should be easy. Ready for orders. Hero. Oh, perfect. On the move. Yes. I don't think he's gonna survive this. Just to make sure, by the way, I'm gonna lock the Crusader, take a bit Show of evasion away, got. and uh, yeah, shoot the crap out of this guy. Give him everything you've got. Got him. We got him. Got him. Got him. Standing by. Okay, we're here for the follow-up. No follow-up. So we do it like that. Locking on target. Just shoot him regularly. Let's go. Sometimes Let's an auto go. attack is exactly Good. what we want. Uh, down here. A little bit closer. Go and actually, I'm gonna offensively push this guy, just to make sure that he's never gonna have a turn anymore. Hit them hard. This attack was very low impact anyway. Might as well use it as a as a tactical thing to do here. Commander. Oh, jet booster. Should turn it off now. Here we go. It's not needed anymore. Crit on the engine through armor. Nice. You've got my attention. Yeah, Crusader needs to actually come up. Orders? Yeah, there's nothing I can do here. Engaging jump jet. Eh. Orders? Yeah, there's nothing I can do. I have to wait for him. Commander? Unless my long term destroys him now. Let's see. It's good. Was a nice hit, but it wasn't enough. Let them make the first mistake. Yeah. All right. So. Ready for orders. I guess what we do is we're gonna just try to get as close as possible, as quickly as possible. Let's go vigilant so that we are having Talk to me. the chunk of initiative next round. I'm leaping. Right. Alright, so still got missiles. Let's drop missiles. Copy that. Let's get this and done. that's it. Alright, good mission. Target I'm pretty happy and pretty pleased with what we got today. So the five skulls are 
Mission I'd say successful. good for us. If you want to farm a little, we're going to take them. If you want to get a challenge, we go all six, seven skulls, which we are able to get done, but with a cost. So that's cool. Let's go. What do you think about the daisy cutter? Good? Yes? No? Maybe? I don't know. We also want to build our builds. That's the thing that I want to start uh, doing now so that we can jump into the next uh, fight in the next episode with our new stuff. That's enhanced imaging, you say? I like that. I like that a lot. I think I'll take it. Albatross, what do you bring to the table? Nothing. Cascatel? I don't think so. I don't feel like it. Good old Crusader. Nope. Good old Ghost. Anything? Mm -hmm. uh, it's come Sweet Plus is not really that interesting. Nova. Yeah, Nova. Nova doesn't have the engine anymore. But Nova has the rock too. And some heat sinks. I'm gonna disassemble. Cool. Griffin, fine. Into air rockets. No. ATM 6. Not bad. Not bad at all. I want a 15, honestly. These weapons are very, very good. And then the question is, do we take the Rock 2 clan or not? If we want it, we take it. We probably also need ammo. And that's the thing that doesn't fit in this, uh, in this cluster anymore. Unless we get it randomly. Pharaoh, Warfare. Long-term ammo. There's a double bin. I feel like it's not good enough. Uh, do we take this paperweight now? This paperweight of a rotary 2 in the hopes that we get the ammo? Or do we leave imaging there? Or do we leave LRM here? Rock 2 clan is good. It's really good. It's decent range, good damage output. And very light, comparatively. 2% jam chance, recall of 1 per shot above 3, so 4, 5, 6 is jam, also is recall affected. Super easy to counter that. I like it. Is there anything that is money? Could also take an ATM 9, go more ATM. Weird. Weird, 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 weird. Hmm... Okay, so I, I would say we, we're lucky today, all right? So we are super lucky. We're going to take the rock. We're going to take the ammo randomly. Let's see. I don't, I don't really care about this. It doesn't make a big difference here. So AMS Flare is fine. Long Tom Cannon has a self knockdown. 50%. Ooh, I'll get out of here. So we get imaging. We get scatter. We didn't get the ammo. But again, that's perfectly fine. So uh, this is just an investment into the future. What's more important is the enhanced imaging. And what's more important is the LRM-15. This is going to be a real nice combo piece for our Vulture. It's going to be really good. Speaking of, our refit is currently revolving around ATMs on the Timberwolf and micro-missiles on the Marauder, the Flying Marauder, the Flying Timby, the whatever you want to call it. Marauder, Catapult, Mad Cat. We'll see. Okay. I really hope that we can make this happen. I think the minimum I want is Micro Missile 40 on the flyer. If we get 50, I'd be happy. The absolute bare minimum is Micro Missile 40. Okay, 300,000. Yeah, still a good chunk of damage here, mostly because of the Diablo. It's so, so expensive to repair. But we still got 4.4 million C bills before the next financial report, and that's what I'm very happy about. So Marauder needs to be on top. I want this. Atlas is on the bottom. I don't care about it right now. It can be repaired whenever we are getting to another planet or so. So that's gonna be my order. Okay, let's wait some days. Yeah, still 1.9 mil. Beautiful. Does it mean we're gonna upgrade Argo directly? I feel like it, yeah. Let's go and just get these garden upgrades and stuff like that. Doesn't matter which one. I just want to upgrade these so I don't have to think about them anymore. Marauder two days, stop here. Oh, by the way, is there... Oh, we've got some time still. If there's a duel, I would probably take that. There's a solo. There's a duo as well. Alright, so here's the thing. We'll actually test run our new friends. Let's go. 
Here's the Marauder. Again, we got a crit on the ATM, uh, which I will not fix right now. It'll happen later. Okay, we have a combination of medium and small lasers. Okay. Supercharger Talons? We'll never use them. These are just wasted weight. I drop him. I mean, it was something that we put in the mag because we didn't have any slots, but still weight left over, so that was fine. But let's go ahead and add the micro missiles. We have two MMS 30. Do they fit? We're too heavy. Okay. Let's be real. Do we want these lasers? If we drop them, we will generate three tons. We can drop the supercharger, it's a fourth ton. So we have four tons of ammo for whatever that is. I was thinking about dropping engine heat sinks, but that's not possible. Interface cockpit. Is interface cockpit better than... Yeah, it's better than enhanced imaging right now, because it gives us more evasion, right? Yes. I could just decide to not go for the 60, and I could go for the 50 instead. Uh, let's, let's drop the 20 here. That's the 30 again. Come on. This one here. No! What? Stop it here. That one. So, with this, I'd be... I'd be per perfectly fine. Oh, wait! Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. I think we can make it happen. It, it is... It would be a... An experiment. If we drop the lasers, we would also lose a lot of heat generation. That means we could possibly drop this engine heat sink. Negative 22. Mm, this is a bit on the edge. But maybe we have emergency cooling system or so. Plus two. Fine. Yeah. Doable. Totally doable. Uh, we can also drop the weapon mount heat. We don't need them anymore. Yeah, this is getting somewhere. I like where this is going. Really, really good. Alright, so far so good. Now we need to think about ammunition. We're gonna take double bin and another double bin. It's one inferno. 300 shots. I feel like I need two infernos. A, that's a double heat sink kit as well. Do we have a radical? We do have a radical. This is gonna be really good. Yes. Totally worth the rebuild. Uh, so, the thing is, we have a negative 30 heat now. When we jump around, we generate a lot of jump heat. And if we go fire and forget, we generate an extra 42 heat compared to our base heat with the target lock attack. And I wanna go fire and forget a lot. So, we would generate more heat, but we also have two instances of heat down because of emergency cooling system and radical heat sink kit. That's good. I think this is viable here. Going for the leg armor up. Okay, that's the build. I don't know what else to say, but I feel like... It is better now. We got a daisy cutter, opening up things, and then following up with lots of micro missiles. I'm all for it. Let's go. That's really good. Now we can also take a look at our Timby. Where is the Timby? Still in repair, you say? Interesting. You on top? Timby on top? Okay. Because I want to upgrade that thing as well, and then we play a duel. I'm excited, guys. I think this is the right call here. Get that Timberwolf online again. Have Ether on the battlefield. He's really good with the Timberwolf. All right. Now, we're going for ATMs. One here, got one here. Both are fixed now? That's funny. Cool. So we got the battle computer heat, battle computer optics. It's good. One AMS. I wonder if this should be an AMS Mark II. And the answer is always yes, right? Gonna upgrade that. Absolutely. Cool. So, double ATM 12. Uh, it's nothing too exciting as a build yet. Still have some heat left over. We can, uh, we can add some lasers if we wanted to. We could maybe add another... Ah, uh, not really. Can we? 
possible? Wait a moment. 12 goes here. 6 goes here. 6 goes here. Not enough slots. NSS is problematic. If we drop it... We have 36 ATMs that we can fire. We have no ammo yet. Sure. But we are fine in terms of heat. If we keep the, the NSS and go for... Uh, structure, come on. Industrial clan. Is that possible? It is. Negative 14 heat. I like what I see. I really do. So maybe we are not running an AMS on this guy, but put it in another mech. It hurts a bit, but we need ammo. The other option would be dropping one of those sixes and just doing more ammo stuff. We'll see. Uh, it's always a nice balance act. So what do we need? We need uh, um, high explosives. Absolutely. We need regular ammo. And I think regular ammo is going to be our bread and butter ammo. So we'll take three bins. One extended range. One high explosive. 60 shots. So that's two alpha strikes. Okay, so the overall ammo. Wait, this is all 60, right? We have one, two, three, four, five. So we have like 300 shots. That's not even 10 alpha strikes. Uh, I need to drop one of those. It's important. Okay, let's do it like that. Cool. One more high explosive. Put it on that arm. Another one? Sure. Should we keep our AMS now? It would work. Barely. One ton of ammo, minimum. I, I want to have two. Maybe we go with regular AMS. I think we can fuel that with one. So, wait. No, 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 no. That and drop a little bit of leg armor as per usual. A bit of back armor. We're good. So, that is a build. Totally is. Uh, heat management is good, I guess. Negative 24. We are so fine here. We also got a... Radical and an emergency cooling system. Perfect. Jump booster exchanger is here. Do we need exchanger? Not necessarily. That allows for some other shenanigans on this. But we have none. Uh, like a bolt on maybe? Bolt on rockets? Nah. I don't see anything here that I... That I want. So, exchanger is fine, but again, not necessary. A flare would help to intercept some more missiles, if we want that. Bolt on rockets. Carry capacity is still here. We could run this. For a bit of extra punch. Negative 8 heat. But if we jump, we generate heat. But at the same time, again, we have the radical and the emergency coolant system. It's, everything is fine. Guess I keep the rockets? I really don't feel like it, but... Uh, there must be something better. Optics is not needed. There's also an... There's an argument for running Advanced Optics Mark II and drop the Battle Computer Optics. So we have another ton for more ammo. And that's exactly what we do. That's exactly what we do, and I think... I'll upgrade to a Mark II... Take another bin of caseless. Put that in here. Drop half a ton of armor. And we're good. Okay, guys. That's going to be our Timberwolf. I really hope it's going to work. I don't know. We'll see. Investment worth? 300,000 sea bills? Probably. Yes. So, that being said. We want to play the duel. That's the last thing for today. Uh, Timberwolf RC. No, I want Marauder Zop. There we go. Six days. Cool. Jump, jump around. Do you want to make a change to the KFC console while we are orbiting Clinton? What does that mean? Keep KF console active. Deactivate KF console. Keep it active. No lasting consequences. We'll continue using a pirate point for your next jump. I have no idea what that means. We'll figure it out over time. So three days. Bam. All right. 
So guys, here we go. We are getting into the next mission. It's gonna be a duel. It's gonna be a solo duel. It's not gonna be easy. And I hope that the build works. If not, I'd be so sad. Um, yeah, let's quickly load the clear lands. Zap. Cool. We want... Uh, where is that thing? God, we have so many things, actually. The Marauder. We want Jamie. And we want to go in. Let's go. Okay, guys, let's go. Oh, man. So. Um... Yeah, we're gonna jump for 15. We wanna figure out what we are facing. Seems to be a mauler. Just saw the silhouette for a second. And the build got so easy, right? So straightforward. Daisy Cutter, double MMS. How can I Nothing help? else. Let him come to me. Your buddy, you missed. Mostly. I've got your back. Alright. Again, we wanna go fast. Let's go a supercharger. And we get 15. No, we cannot. However, we can get 14 point blank. This daisy cutter, by the way, has a quite high area of effect. So it doesn't really synergize well with our micro missiles who want to be like really close. Let's go here. Copy that. Hello. Okay. Daisy cutter only 47. We go for a fire and forget shot. Oh, the heat is on. Miscalculated. All right. All right. I want to see it. Confirm. Big butter boom, baby. Cool. That was good. And we didn't take damage from our own bomb. That's pretty nasty. Uh, 11 evasion. Okay, so what if we just move around? Accelerating to maximum speed. We generate way too much heat here. These are already active. Will this kill? Alright, we need more cooling. We certainly need more cooling. That's not working. And it feels like we're not really getting that much damage done comparatively. Print for 10. Get in there. I need to cool down now. So we go double target lock. I mean, he's not really doing anything. Oh, I think I made the mech worse, honestly. And it's mostly because of, of the heat management. I cannot go and unleash my full damage potential all the time. It's obviously bad for us. Let's uh, finish him, though. Yeah. That's, that's way too much. And even our radicals are not kicking in. Uh, will we kill? I think we will. Aye, aye. Come on. Got it. Battle neck down. It's a pretty crazy amount of damage that we do, but it's so splashy and random. I feel like our, what was that, 10, 12 damage high explosive ATMs, although they were less impacts, they had more damage overall. We're shooting, let's see, we're shooting 60, 120, 120 instances of three. So there's like 360 overall damage potential, like Super Splash. The other ones were 24 times like 12. And it comes to the same number. Hmm. 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 But then also we had we had lasers on top of that. And we had no heat problems. Alright, I need to figure this out. Uh I cannot take the model as it is. I have to disassemble it. All right, that's pretty fun. A lot of stuff is still here. There is nothing that we want, though. So I'm gonna take them all up. Boom, bam. Armored Cowl. I don't know, I've gotta keep it around. I'm, I was here for the money anyway. But yeah, guys, what do you think? What do we do with our build here? How do we change it? I don't know yet. Let me know down below in the comments. Um, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.